So, und da sind wir wieder bei The Walking Dead. Und wir müssen uns entscheiden, was wir tun. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. <clears throat> Okay, das heißt, wir können jetzt wieder ein bisschen äh, frei rumlaufen und ich kann vielleicht da wieder mal ein bisschen mehr erzählen, wobei ich gar nicht weiß, was ich hier so groß erzählen soll, aber, ähm, ich schätze mal, wir reden erstmal mit Mark. So, what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. Okay, Mark hat nicht viel zu erzählen. Was haben wir denn hier alles? Hier haben wir zum Beispiel einen Generator. What's that? Generator. <laughs> you guys come along with gas just in time. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Er will uns nicht so richtig an den Generator dran lassen. Warum auch immer, aber okay. Hier können wir raus. Wollen wir gerade noch nicht? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Uh, like us. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. <laughs> well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Wie schon gesagt habe, das Ganze hört sich ein bisschen zu gut an. Zu schön, um wahr zu sein. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can. It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Okay, dann schubsen wir den nochmal weg. Looks like he's stuck. Hmm. Disgusting. Uh. 
Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. These folks are just delaying the inevitable. This place is gonna fall apart, just like everywhere else. <sighs> Maybe you're right. There's another one. I see it. Fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Auch nicht schön. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but. It's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Schauen wir mal. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. Little... Und so, so, so. Holy fuck! Oh. What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ah! Oh god. Ah! What the? Get to the gate. Oh uh oh. Get down. You Jesus. We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. Come on out. We müssen den Traktor irgendwie verschieben. Hier wird vielleicht. Das hier. The blades are stuck in the dirt. Ah, okay. Was ist denn jetzt noch los? Ist hier oben noch irgendwas? Ah. Okay. Uh. So. Shit, something's still blocking. Get out of the old stop shooting. Tja, ich weiß noch nicht, wie wir äh Hier muss doch Oh Gott, oh Gott. Ah, hier okay. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Oh, da bleibt der stecken. Okay. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. Okay, wir haben es geschafft. Ah. 
Wir müssen weiter. Noch einer. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Oh Gott. Oh Gott. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. The gate's right there. Oh Gott, wie schnell ist er denn? Let's get out of here. Das ist keine gute. Das ist keine gute Idee, den Zaun offen zu lassen. Lee, what's wrong? The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit! Are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, Mama. Yeah. I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark! Oh my god! What happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Christ, maybe you were right about this place, Lee. Es ist nicht so sicher, wie wir dachten. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down. But I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Tja, dann können Clementine und Co. und, und Doc. Clementine und Co. sage ich schon, so viele sind es auch gar nicht. Dann können Clementine und Duck auch mal ein bisschen schaukeln. Kann man eigentlich von der Schauke erschlagen werden? Ich glaube ja nicht. Nein. <lacht> okay. Äh, warte mal, was ist das da? Wir schauen uns erstmal alles an. Mehr hast du dazu nicht zu sagen, Lee? Hm. Oh, bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. 
If a couple of tools out of the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor inn. Tja, im Motor inn. Jetzt können wir uns den Generator mal anschauen. Okay, da ist aber nicht auch nicht viel. Gehen wir mal ins Tor. Wer ist eigentlich der Tierarzt? Ich weiß das gar nicht. Lots of hay. Uh, enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. Hm. Okay, hier geht's nicht weiter. Dann schauen wir doch mal hier rein. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. If there's not enough room in the okay. house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Okay, da sagt er mir nur dasselbe. Was ist hier? Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Okay. Was sagen Sie denn? Er sagt gar nichts. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? That'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? Hmm. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Hmm. Hey. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Does he treat you like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much. And lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. I'm gonna go check things out. Okay. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Okay. Äh, wir sehen uns in der nächsten Folge wieder. Ich habe schon ein bisschen überzogen wieder, aber können wir ja auch mal machen. Ähm, bedanke mich fürs Zusehen und äh, bis zum nächsten Mal. Ciao.